Hello, Secrets readers. I'm Carlo LaRosso, Senior Editor of Secrets of Home Theater and High Fidelity website. And today what we have for you is the BMW Diamond Series uh, 803D3 uh, floor standing loudspeaker. This is the newest iteration of um, BMW's well-regarded and um, some say legendary uh, uh, 800 series loudspeakers, uh, a lot of which are found in a number of record famous recording studios around the world. Um, this is the third from the top of the line in the uh, in the series. And pan over to this one over here, and um, it uh, it com it represents a complete uh, redesign and re-engineering um, of the 800 series line. BMW took about seven or eight years to completely. Uh, top to bottom, redo their thinking and and uh, come up with some new uh, technologies and solutions for this line. Um, so the uh, first thing you'll notice is that the uh, the aesthetics of the of the speaker are significantly different from the previous generation. Um, beauty is always in the eye of the beholder, but uh, personally, I think these are absolutely stunning speakers. Uh, the Art Deco design of them, I think, is just gorgeous. The unit that the um the head unit that holds the mid-range driver uh it's just got a they call it the um the turbine head is just a really i think stunningly designed to look at um other uh features are this uh al aluminum spine that runs the length of the back uh to help uh give extra support to the speaker there's um a significant use of aluminum in the, in the entire design of the structure of the speaker uh, that whole head unit is completely um, uh, machined and supported with uh, aluminum ribs, and so is that uh, tweeter uh, enclosure. Um, one of the things that remains from the uh, previous generation is the diamond impregnated tweeter, hence the D in the D in the uh, diamond series uh, nomenclature. The mid-range has been redesigned. Uh, gone is the yellow Kevlar. Uh, driver, which is replaced by a newly designed material called uh, Continuum. Uh, it's um, a composite of some sort, uh, not Kevlar, but uh, it's uh, it's been um, engineered to be uh, to provide a much better um, mid-range uh, clarity and response. The base drivers are have also been redesigned, and the material is also new, and it's uh, I believe it's called Aerofoil. Um, Again, a, uh, a, a new development for BMW. And it's said to help improve uh, bass response and, uh, and reproduction. So um, there you have it. A really gorgeous looking and very striking speaker. There's its mate over there. Um, have a look at the review and uh, to find out what we think. And um, just uh, enjoy. Thanks so much.